Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Dragon Seeds. Uh, last episode we just got done training muscle at the training center. And now uh, we're going to go ahead and just kind of jump into the battle arena so you guys can see what uh, fighting in the tournament is like. Okay, let's see information. Um let's go with the nail on that one. So registration is at three. Just go ahead and hit fight. Okay, so the first thing we do we fight under is baby class. And then yeah, if you once you beat the A rank you can go into next class, which just goes baby junior adult and then the WDC champion. And uh you got change rank E, D, C, B, A, obviously the higher out up. The, apparently the harder the opponent is. So it's usually good just to kinda of go through. Plus you get a trophy for each challenger rank you go through, so. And then fight money. It's the money you earn if you beat all three fights which are in each rank. So let's just go ahead and start off with the e rank. So if someone will be watching this rank, are you sure you want to enter this rank? Of course, we gotta get that trophy. And then it tells you which round you're in. Baby class E round one, opponent dragon and crustacean aqua. Looks like your opponent is tough. So let's take a look at Hopefully we do well. I really do love music in this game. Great music. Okay, so yes, he's clearly got much higher HP than I do. So however, I believe Storm has the advantage against Aqua Elements, so. First thing, of course, I want to do is I want to get rid of all of his reflections. Now, I didn't set the options, which you can do. You can set the options so that I can see how many reflections he has, how many specials he has, all that kind of stuff. I also even take away his HP to make the game harder. I like to keep HP in there, but I do like to keep the reflections and the specials out of there so that it is a little bit more of a challenge to it. So Now, you win if you either kill your opponent or time runs out and you have the most HP. So let's see if we can get him here. Damn, really fast. Okay, he just did a taunt move. Uh oh. Got us there. Let's try this again. There we go. So my, I believe my special is probably weaker than his, however, since I'm Storm, uh, a little more of an advantage. Plus, it's also uh, some of the better graphics in the game right here, you know. So used to seeing is those flat 2D images, and then you are just kind of thrust into, uh, into this 3D realm here. Pretty nice. I, I really like it. Kind of like the background they got going on there. Okay, I think he shot... Oh, I guess that'd make four, four or five reflections. He should be out. And as you can see, I'm also out of uh, reflections myself, so... Oh, okay, I was wrong. Yep, now he's out. That has been confirmed. So now we're just going to start swinging the sword at him. There we go. Ooh. I don't know, this might be close. Uh, pretty close. Come on. If he doesn't get a critical, it should be good. Ah, uh, one away. Come on, get him. And he's down. That was a pretty close fight. Not bad. And then you're just going to be thrusted right into the second round. You can't quit or anything. Uh, Beetle Storm. Oh, by the way, also, if you think your dragon's going to die, you can, uh, surrender. And then, of course you lose, but you get to keep dragging. If your dragon dies, that's it, it's the end. You've gotta go clone a new one and start over. Oh. Already starts off with this. Man, he's got a lot more HP than I do. No real advantage here, either. Much nicer reflector than I do. 
So I'm going to try to drain his uh, specials here. I can. So yeah. That's the one of the unfortunate things is usually I stick to one strategy here and that would be kind of keep away. Hope, you know, I can get all his back out. Here's a good one here. Is we're in the center ring, which is, you know, usually just for muscle and sword. If you do a back and a special, a lot of times he's going to try, well, usually he'll try to swing at you. But it works quite often. Not always, though. This is a very rock, paper, scissors game. You're just hoping you get lucky. So we're back up, hopefully, get a. knock another special back at him. Special run. Damn it. Sick of your crap. Oh. Take that. Alright. I guess he's out, but obviously it was wrong, so we'll do one more set of reflections here. Hopefully he. Okay, it looks like he's trying to. Alright. Another good strategy is since he has a lot more HP than I do, I want him to obviously take the first move towards me. So I'll try to move close to centering, but hope he comes in and just keeps swinging so I can get at least the first shot in there. Oh! See? I'm always wrong. Man. Alright, come on. There we go. Alright, now we're gonna wanna... Oh, this might not turn out so well. Uh-oh. Back up a bit here. Back up. Back up. Okay, what try to do is swing and a back up. Swing and a back up, you just kind of hit. Back up, try to get out of his way here. Do a couple more backups here, get out of his way. Oh, he's following me. Okay. Yeah, might not win this one. And you see the time only counts down when you're actually doing something, not just sitting here trying to decide something. Just swing and a back up, come on. Come on. Oh crap. Let's back up. There we go. Yep, oh, he got me. See, I lost because the time ran out, I had to lower HP, but I didn't lose my dragon at least. Ah, very successful. So, and then there's the losing money again. Another quick tip if you want to earn money and don't care about your standings, which let me show you a quick show data circle. You can see how many times you won, won, loss, uh, killed one, lost one, tells you type, how many uh, special your points are, and all that fun stuff. And you can get up as high as 999 or 99, depending on how many digits are there. Then it tells you about your weapons, your evasion. So, well, let's see. I try not to rest too much because resting will give you more HP but also increase your weight. So I like to kind of go around the shops and stuff. See if I can't find anything good. Nothing. Alright. Hopefully we'll get there and find something nice. Also do a, a lot more training too. Let's go back to the junk shop again. So you can see my HP went up a little bit. It's at 130 right now. So we'll go up again. Ah, here we go. Let's see what you got. Uh, of course I got no money to buy anything. Increases your dragon's power. So Iron Weed gives you more strength. And Ice Jewel, which I can't use anyway since I'm a Storm Dragon, increases your uh, special attack. So. Now we're gonna exit. That's what we're gonna do. We need more money. To get more money, we need to be strong. So, real quick, we're gonna go to Training Center. Show you the next. Uh, Training we can do. We already seen muscle. And here's special. All right, special has these three colored squares. Push X, and they scroll on the screen. So you just kind of stare at it, and then remember where they're at. And you pick where the one it tells you that. Like that's where blue's at. Uh, not the easiest thing to do. I mean. It, if you're really good at kind of just staring at things, oh man, I think, I think this is it. Oh, okay, all right, one more time. And it's random colors; it's not always blue. All right, come on, let's get it perfect here. 
Okay, I think I got that one. Ah, see, this one's red. Red's right here. Alright, and then we got 20 extra units to our special attack. Pretty easy. Alright. Well, unfortunately, we're out of time for this episode. Hopefully, uh, next episode we'll actually win a tournament round. A tournament round. Um, I think I'll probably do a little more training, uh, off screen here. Try to get my dragon a little bit stronger. Hopefully, actually, be a threat. So, anyway, thanks for watching this episode of Let's Play Dragon Seeds, and I'll see you guys later.